It's turtle time. Subscribe, share, give us some love. Hey everybody. In today's video, we are up in my little turtle lab and we're gonna be taking a look at some of these colonians and whatnot. So stay tuned and we're gonna give you the sneak peek. <laughs> I have the big light on a timer from either 7 or 8 in the morning until 3 in the afternoon, which it is 3 in the afternoon. So I'm just going to plug that in and override her. And we'll start peeking around here at some of these taters. Here's a group of reeves. This guy actually, um, a girl, I got her from an expo. I got two of these from an expo and you can see the tail's like really short and nubby and um, she actually prolapsed and I had to Tie it off, a dry doctor, and it fell off, kind of like banding a goat. But um, she's just like a pet now. But I got this one at the expo as well, another female. And then I have a male in here. like Chinese mud turtles. All right, now we're gonna go straight down. And actually, I'm gonna go back up because uh, the Latin name on these beauties is Maremi's Rivesi. And you're gonna notice a trend with most of these turtles that I'm gonna show you. This turtle here is Maremi's Niger Cans. I think this is a male. I have two. Oh no, this is the bin that I have the two. Maybe females. And this is the bin that I have. Could be. Cute. Oh. All right, now we're gonna go across from the Quang Tong River Turtles, those Maremi's Niger cans, ah. to a small Chinese golden thread that I have been raising up in hopes that it be male and I'm pretty sure that it's not. <laughs> so I have two females. I'd like to get a group of these started so I'm trying to find a male. And that is Maremi sinensis. Now these little guys, this little gal or girl, man, whatever it's gonna be, is a Maremi's Mudica Cami. And once again, it's a Maremi's. I just love, most of the Maremi's are Asian. I just love them. There's another 
one back here. I have some guppies started, and mosquito fish, some of these, papyrus. And now this bin is gonna bring us to our next contestant. This goofy thing is Chinese box turtle, Flavo marginata, Kuora, and I have several other Kuora. The um, Malaysian box turtles, Kuora and Boinensis, uh, are outside, so I'm not going to show you them, but this is one of the Chinese. This is the other smaller Chinese. He likes to just hide by this piece of coral. This tub set up just set up recently but we have one last Maremis that I wanted to show you guys before we go to the last Corora that I'm gonna show you guys and these are the Vietnamese pond turtles These are Maremi's Anamensis. Three. Let's see. I think they're all female. Males are going to be really hard to find, I'm afraid. So, that's what I'm doing setting up my groups. I'm just trying to find certain sexes of what I need to set up these pairs and groups. And here's the last one. This is the grand finale. These are Cora Cyclornata Anamitica. Or Vietnamese three-lined box turtles. everyone outside this summer and I just brought everyone in because I wanted to be able to monitor their eating food intake a little bit more closely Where's everyone? Where's everyone? and they really are very aquatic they just blend right in. And a little tote bag. Ah, ha 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 ha. There we go. What's the other one? They remind me of a North American wood with all that orange legs and neck. I love them.